It's nearly impossible to get a hot tub by yourself on a cruise, but look at me, chilling, solo, and there's a way to do it. I will to tell you how to do it in this video, but you might know. I have no desire to go back into that Dominican sun. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. I wanna relax in my room and just lay down, but I don't have Wi-Fi in there. I think that's God telling me, you ain't paying less money to be up in your room. Uh, I want to go to Guy's Freaking Anchor and try the Mac Daddy Mac and Cheese. I figured nobody might, it might be empty, right? I think. Or is it on this side? It might be on this side. I'm gonna ask somebody. Excuse me, you know where guys, guys pig and anchor is? Oh, I wanted that. Okay, thank you. All right, I can't have pig and anchor today. Maybe I'll get it tomorrow. That sucks. And now I have to get something else. Right, let's go up to the food floor. Oh man, I'm coming back down here because this is where the hot tubs look the most appealing. Um, lunch was exceptionally good today. Shout out to Lisa who's at the um, deli every day. She's so sweet. It's become a nice treasure to see her. Right, so this is a casino. It's pretty empty because everybody's out. <laughs> Hey lovers, it's your girl Luxury Leah and right now I'm exploring deck five. I wanted to go to Guys Pick an Anchor, but I also have plans to hit the hot tub. That's why I have on my swimsuit. This is how you get a hot tub that is completely empty or close to empty me. on a cruise. Wait until a port date. This is also why port days are the best days to hit the hot tubs. Check it out. It's at this point that I had the hot tub all to myself and I'm just chilling and I realized that a port day is the best day, if not the only day, to get in a hot tub. I spent a good amount of time in the water. I'm surprised I didn't wrinkle up like a prune, but you know how I do. I did my thing, flirted with the camera, and it wasn't long before I had company. A lady came with her husband and hey, it's a public space. Welcome. Uh, and mermaid days are over. Then she makes me do it with her, and I'm like, what is going on? So if you don't make me do it, then I do not do it. No, I won't. I won't. <laughs> Seriously, tell me if I may be blowing things out of proportion, but the way she got in the tub and was like, oh, I know people that do that vlogging thing. Um, They always try to put me in it. I don't care though, as long as you don't try to put me in it. Ma'am, I don't know you. Why would I put you in it? At what point would it be interesting for me to put you in it when you're just sitting there drinking a beer in the hot tub out the can? Like, don't nobody want to see that. You know what I'm saying? So I felt like, shut the fuck up. Like, she could've just got in the tub, sat there, drank her beer out of the can with her man and like, you know, mind her fucking business and maybe observe and see what I was doing and she would've noticed that I would not be filming her ever. Unless somebody paid me to do that. I don't think that would happen. So I moved out that tub. And I moved on to another tub where she and was not. I felt way more better. So I still only stayed there until I, I wanted to. And then once I was over it, I was out. All right. I took a little time to hit the hot tub since guys, pig and anchor wasn't open. I didn't get to try the mac and cheese. But I did get some good mac and cheese from the buffet, surprisingly. And the deli has some good food too. Now I'm literally enjoying the view. And I don't know, it's less hot than being on the island for some reason. I don't know. What time is it? Because we have to be back on the ship by 4 30. Not saying I want to get back off the ship because it's a hassle getting on and off. Not really a hassle, but it's a long walkway. Let's see if I can show you. the length of the ship to get on, just to get on board. 
So I think I'm gonna knot. I'm gonna knot. I'm gonna knot. I'll take this moment to reflect on the Wi-Fi here on the Carnival Magic. It was horrible. To be fair, I stayed on deck two. So maybe because I was like lower, I, I didn't get good service. But I had horrible, horrible service on this ship. I could only use my Wi-Fi if I camped out in the in front of my door. So I would take the cushions from my couch and like lay them out and just like kind of lay there so that I can use my phone and like and be comfortable it was awful I, I didn't like that at all all right so the couple didn't leave and i decided if y'all not gonna leave then i'm gonna leave because i don't want to be with y'all no offense y'all could go ahead and be a romantic so they had several hot tubs on this floor and i took advantage of that and i even went ahead and say oh, why don't i take advantage of another hot tub there's other hot tubs as well so i wanted to explore some of those and that's what i did i spent the whole day exploring hot tubs i guess you can say it was for research purposes yeah i wanted to show you guys how the hot tubs were looking so i had to try them all and i can't say that the hot tubs on the fifth floor deck five were my favorite the serenity pool hot tubs was mid yeah deck five had all the popping hot tubs on the carnival magic i did go to the spa and the spa had some really nice hot tubs like if i'm being honest those are the best hot tubs they have the jet and like the it's just nice we're gonna see that later on in the vlog so stay tuned i think it's hilarious that i didn't realize that people from the other ship and my ship were watching me until it was too late then i was like oh hi waving at them and i'm like why y'all watching me like if i didn't have a um a balcony but if i did i wouldn't be sitting there watching people use the hot tub i would have been like doing something but i guess that's something they're probably like what the hell this little black girl vlogging in the hot tub like she ain't never been nowhere no it's not that it's for research okay so if you're watching this now know that know that this was research oh, I switched. This is my other ship. oh i need a ship Just like that, I'm off to the next hot tub. This one is on the Serenity deck. Just for reference as well, I am five foot seven and a hundred and something pounds. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. But I'm a medium sized, slim, slim thick, and I have plenty of room in the hot tub. I think they usually, well, the ones on the fifth floor, they fit about four people comfortably, four to six max. And then these up here on Serenity, they 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 only for three or four. Period. Like don't even try it. And I'm talking about medium sized people. This is not plus size friendly. I'm gonna for real i'm just saying so i'm walking around right now on the serenity deck you see those cabanas in the background they're quite comfortable it's hard to get one on a regular day because they get crowded fast i don't think there are enough to accommodate all the people but when there's nobody on the ship like a day like a poor day you can really enjoy and indulge and that's exactly what i did i found myself relaxing breathing thinking i love my thoughts just being alone with my thoughts it doesn't scare me at all i actually have the best and most amazing brilliant idea is when i can like recharge so this was really good for me i recharged a bit and then i was like all right now let's get these cute little pictures in you know how we do it and then how about a couple more drinks and then i don't know let's just call it a day it's been a day you know let's get ready for dinner let's have a nightcap because we got a cute little red dress that we're putting on so make sure you check out the next video because you don't want to miss that i had to bring some cosplay with me on my trip because i'm a cosplayer i love the cosplay so i brought this this is from demon slayer if you know you know if you don't know 
know, check it out. Maybe it's something you like. If not, that's okay too. But I think it's really cute. And I made it a moment. I took some pictures, posted them on the gram. They went up, up, up. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. And this was a cute little corner right on the Serenity deck. I was always looking for spots that I could take pictures, that I could pose. Because I'm like, I want to get the best out of this. I'm a digital content creator and it's important for me to get those cute little looks. And I would say that on a ship, there are enough places where you can take cool pictures. And it might not even look like a ship depending on how you frame it. So tell me right now, like seriously, does it look like I'm like on a ship? If you didn't know, would you know? You wouldn't know. Especially like if I cropped it a certain way, you wouldn't, you wouldn't know. Okay, I took a lot of pictures up here. I feel really good about that. I'm gonna have a drink. Now they call it Kiss My Lips. It's very pretty. That's my name on it. Let's go. Okay, so that pretty much sums up our video. If you liked it, don't be shy. Give this video a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe and come back and watch the next one. Or just binge watch a bunch because that's amazing.